and welcome back to my channel. My name is Katie and today I have a new topic for you and that is I'm going to teach you on how to upload files to your Canva account so you can use them if you wanted to start from scratch or if you wanted to design something that is not in Canva and you wanted to incorporate things that probably you have gotten for free like freebies through creative market, design cuts, and all the other freebie sources out there. Are you ready? I'm ready so let's get started. So the window that you are looking at right now is the window that you will see right after you log into your account. So you have to make sure that you have an account on Canva before you will do the process that we are gonna do today. I'm using right here a free Canva account. I'm not logged in to my Canva for Work account. So this is a new interface as well. Um, the reason I decided to create this video using my free account is because I received a question and she was wondering why her Canva interface doesn't look like my old Canva interface. Like I said earlier, I am going to teach you today on how to add photos or graphic design elements to your Canva account. So what you need to do is to click on folders. You will find folders on the left sidebar here in this area and you have to click on folders. And since you are or we are on a free account right now, we are only allowed to have two folders if you have a canva for work account you will have unlimited folders now see here there's purchased folders there's uploads and create photo folders we are not able to do this because again we are on a free canva account now we have to click on uploads remember that in your uploads folder each folder can only contain up to 200 files all right so now we already have 20 right here i got this freebie this free pack from creative market so don't forget every monday check out the website for freebies i will leave a link in the description box down below so that you can click that and you can go straight ahead to the freebies corner okay so now we are in the uploads folder what i'm gonna do is to click on upload all right and i'm gonna choose Oh, this is a rather big file. So I'm going to choose another file. Let's see here. Oh, this is a big file as well. So I'm going to go back to my downloads folder and come here in the patterns area. Okay, now I can upload these files. All right. And then once I've chosen the files that I want to upload, just click on choose so that it will start uploading. So the upload speed will actually depend on your internet connection speed. So if you are uploading bigger files, you have to give Canva a little bit of time in order for it to upload on their system. So we have two files uploaded already out of the five. And we'll just have to wait for a little bit. And then I'm going to show you another way to upload a file while you are working on a project. All right, so four files have uploaded. We're waiting for one more and we can exit. Okay, so there you go, it's done. Um, again, the process is that you click on folders, click on uploads folder, and then you can upload the file that you wanted to upload and saved on your account on Canva. The other one is while well, you are creating a file, let's say for example, we are creating an Instagram post like this and we wanted to upload something. See here, after I click on uploads, the uploads folder that we um, saw earlier appeared. Now here you can also upload an image. So let me see if there are different yes there are so i'm gonna wait and choose pineapple and this leaf right here and then this banana and this bird is cute all right so i'm good with those files click on choose and you will see that those files will be uploaded in here and i will be able to use this now 
let's say for example let's design something and then i'll click on this one so in order for me to make this as the background i'm gonna adjust there you go and just um, adjust the spacing and the uh, placement and then if i want to add another um component like i would like to overlay something all i need to do is just to click on it and it will appear at the very center of the file that we are working on so let me just increase the size so you can view it better now see here there's a bounding box so you can adjust the size by dragging on the circles anywhere around the file that we are currently working on so you can also adjust the placement and reposition it anywhere you want it to appear so let's say we want it at the middle and then just put it right there and if i wanted to add a text let's finish this layout i'll just click on text right here at the sidebar and then i will click on a text box so that it will appear and here you go and i'm going to type be like a pineapple now you notice that because of our background our text is not so obvious so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a shape. I'm going here at the elements and click shapes. And then I'm going to choose the square and I'm going to adjust it so it will become a rectangle and change the color to white. And then I'm going to adjust the size and position backward so that the text will appear. I'm going to adjust that a little bit and there you go we already have a design if you wanted to adjust um, the size of our pineapple some more we can do that and I think I'm going to overlap it a bit and position it forward so that the little stalks right here the pineapple leaves will appear on top of the rectangle that we created now there you go that's how easy it is to upload files on your Canva account. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe and click the notification icon as well so that you will be notified when a new video is up. And I'll be recording some more videos in the future. So I hope you will come back to my channel. And thank you, thank you so much for the support. Again, my name is Katie. And I hope you're having an amazing day or night wherever you are. Goodbye now! Bye.